As a tech from one of America's clean power manufacturing giants, I can tell you that the most consistently asked question that we're asked every day is what is dirty electricity? That has subsequent questions. Where does it come from? Can I measure it? Is it something that I should be concerned with? Well, let's do our best to answer that question. What is dirty electricity? And I'll tell you right now that the answer often depends on whom you ask. If somebody gives you a different answer, that doesn't mean that A, they're necessarily wrong, or B, being disingenuous. See, the reality is that alternating current has a lot of aspects, and depending on whom you ask, the answer to dirty electricity may have a different answer. For example, Belkin power strips. These are designed to stop surges. So if you asked Belkin or a surge protection company, what is dirty electricity? They might say a transient, a surge, over voltage. Next, if you asked a breaker company, what is dirty electricity? They might say over amperage. If you asked a stereo or home theater or Wi-Fi company, what is dirty electricity? They might say it's interference, it's distortion that causes that click or pop or tick in the speakers. If you ask a health professional, they might say it's EMF, electromagnetic fields, and there's subsequent radiation. Well, we know that in America, our electricity cycles at 60 Hertz, while in Europe at 50. So what if your electricity cycled at 66 Hertz? Could that be not defined or called dirty electricity? Certainly. At SATIC, we believe the answer to the question, what is dirty electricity, could be any one combination or all of the above. That's why SATIC's product line was designed to treat, filter, and regulate all aspects of alternating current. So by any definition, your electricity will be clean.